aluminium fluoride this is ionic in nature and aluminium chloride this is covalent in nature what is the reason behind this this is today's lesson aluminium fluoride and this is aluminium chloride here the cationic charge is 3 plus and anionic charge is minus this is 3 plus and this is minus in both the compounds aluminium and halogens so both the compounds should be same but one is ionic another one is covalent in nature now let's see the reason behind this this is aluminium 3 plus charge this is fluorine and this is electron cloud this is aluminium 3 plus this is fluorine and this is electron cloud and halogens are fluorine chlorine bromine iodine and astatine this is a radioactive element so it is kept out of consideration from top to bottom along a column in the periodic table atomic sizes increase so chlorine is bigger in size than fluorine from the periodic table we know and for this reason the distance between nucleus and electron cloud in fluoride ion is shorter compared to the chloride ion where the distance between nucleus and electron cloud is longer compared to the fluoride ion and for this reason because of this shorter distance this electron cloud electron cloud in fluoride ion is strongly bonded to the nucleus and in chloride ion because of the longer distance this electron cloud is loosely bonded to the hence this electron cloud is attracted by the aluminium 3 plus which is very limited and in this case this electron cloud is attracted by the aluminium nucleus or aluminium cation since this electron cloud is loosely bonded to the nucleus that is why in this case polarization happens on a large scale but in this case in case of fluoride ion this electron cloud is strongly bonded to the nucleus and polarization is very less that is why the bond between aluminium and chloride ion turns to covalent bond but in this case the bond between aluminium and fluoride ion remains as it is that means ionic bond so because of this low polarization and in this case high polarization aluminium fluoride remains as it is that means ionic compound and in case of aluminium chloride because of a high polarization 
aluminum chloride turns into covalent compound in this way aluminum 3 plus this is fluoride ion fluoride ion fluoride ion here almost no polarization happens and aluminum fluoride remains as ionic compound but in case of aluminum chloride 3 plus this is minus this is minus this is minus in case of aluminum chloride polarization happens to a greater degree and as a result this electron cloud comes to the middle between aluminum 3 plus and chloride ion aluminum 3 plus and chloride ion and as a consequence aluminum chloride turns into covalent compound this is the reason behind covalent and ionic character that means in aluminum chloride chloride ion is polarized to a greater degree that is why aluminum chloride turns into covalent character from the ionic nature but in case of aluminum fluoride no polarization happens because of the shorter distance between nucleus and electron cloud in case of fluoride ion for this reason aluminum fluoride remains as ionic compound this is the reason that means polarization is the factor by which one turns into covalent in nature and another one cannot turn into this is the reason behind aluminum fluoride is ionic compound and covalent character of aluminum chloride is very high. Number today, thank you very much. Take care.